hi guys this is Rome's again I'm back for another video and in this video I'm going to show you another another video another video of my lesson here at native camp so I hope that you're going to enjoy and learn something from this video I keep on saying video 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 that's it so as you can see I'm using the native camp beauty camera I'm really using it I because I really like this app app of native camp so basically we just um, we just go on standby whenever we want whenever we like whenever we think we're available so since I'm available right now I decided to sit down in to sit down on my <laughs> chair and go on standby I want to show you one two three go as you can see it's now loading I can see my face here in this app and also in native camps page so let's see uh, I'm speechless I haven't sent them I haven't sent any message to my previous students because I'm quite busy today I've conducted four lessons this morning and time check it's 9 57 a.m. 10 a.m. to be exact so I hope I can finish another four lessons hopefully I'll be showing you this lesson not to brag but to encourage other applicants other as aspiring native camp teachers don't worry this will be easy this will be quick hi hi good morning good morning good morning can you hear and see me clearly yeah I can see and hear you well wow yes. that's great to hear that by the way my name is Roms and what is your name oh uh, yeah my name is Kotaro Kotaro, nice to meet yeah. you. Ah, nice to meet you too. Yeah. It's good to see you. By the way, Kotaro, I am am I speaking too fast or too slow? Oh yeah, just okay. All right, that's good to hear that. Kotaro, yeah. it's our third lesson together, so I know you are familiar with the <laughs> lesson. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, I can see here that we are going to study daily news in this lesson, and yeah. the title is the wider costs. Um, of the Ukraine conflict is that correct yeah yes correct are you ready yeah yes let's start the lesson Kotaro let's yeah. have words and phrases and mm. let's learn some of the words that are used in the article mm. let's have the first word please repeat after me once after the audio okay. sanction sanction Wow what a good pronunciation sanction yeah. Now let's have. Oh, do you want to read the meaning or? Uh yeah okay yes okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, mm, an action that is taken or uh, know that that is given to force a country to obey international laws by limiting or stopping trade with that country by not allowing economic aid for that country etc. Etc. Thank mm. you so much. Now let's read the sample sentence, Kotaro. Repeat after yeah. me once. Sanctions okay. against the country have been lifted. <coughs> Sanctions against the country have been lifted. Thank you so much. Now let's have the second word. Please listen. Interest rate. Interest rate. All right, thank you. Now let me read the meaning the interest percent that the bank or other financial company charges you when you borrow money or the interest percent it 
pays you when you keep money in an account. Mm. Mm. Okay, let's read the sample sentence. Please repeat after me once. Yeah. The bank has plans to raise interest rates. The bank has plans to raise interest rates. Thank you so much. Now let's have the third <coughs> word. Please listen. Retaliate. Retaliate. Very good. Retaliate is to do something bad to someone who was who has hurt you or treated you ba badly to get revenge against someone. Okay, let's read a sample sentence. The police retaliated with tear gas. The police retaliated with tear gas. Tear gas. Tear gas. Very good. Now next, let's have the fourth word. Impose. 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 Very good. Impose is to cause something such as a tax, mm. fine, rule, or punishment to to affect someone or something by using your authority. Mm. Mm. Now let's read the sample sentence. Please repeat after me once. Very high taxes have recently been imposed on cigarettes. Very high taxes have recently been imposed on cigarettes. Perfect. Do you have any questions, Kotaru? Ah, uh, yeah, correctly. No, so far, yeah, I understood so these far. words. Yes, okay. All right, great. <coughs> now let's move on to the next part comprehension. Please look okay. at the direction. Okay, I'm done checking. Thank you. Now let's move on to the listening focus. Let's check the questions that you will have to answer later. Please look at the questions as I read them twice. Number one, okay. what will sanctions on Russia lead to? Huh. One more time, what will sanctions on Russia lead to? Number two, huh. Huh. what was already being discussed in Europe before the conflict began? Huh. One more time, what was already being discussed in <coughs> Europe before the conflict began? Huh. Number three, why are there concerns that there will be a fall in the number of new cars being produced around the world? Why are there concerns that there will be a fall in the number of new cars being produced around yeah, the world? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Great. Now, let's listen to the audio, Kotaro. It starts okay. now. Yeah. The wider costs of the Ukraine conflict. Although most people are worried about the human cost of war, the conflict between Russia and Ukraine will also have a financial impact on countries around the world. Sanctions on Russia will lead to rising costs in food, fuel and manufactured goods across Europe and beyond. Fears about the rising price of gas and the increasing cost of food were already being discussed in Europe before the conflict began. Now there are worries that interest rates will also rise to levels not seen since the 1980s. This will push prices up even further. Falling shares in stock markets around the world are also scaring people. Retired people saw their pension share prices fall rapidly. They are worried that their savings could be lost. People with mortgages will see their payments increase. As Russia supplies many of the natural materials required in the car manufacturing industry, there are concerns there will be a fall in the number of new cars being produced around the world. If the Russian government decides to retaliate and impose sanctions of its own, the impact of this conflict will be felt by everyone in one way or another. <coughs> well done. <laughs> Okay, this time let's proceed to answer the questions. Okay. Okay, I'll read each question and please say your answers out loud. Let's start with number one. Yeah. What will sanctions on Russia lead to? Uh, sanctions on Russia will lead to rising costs in food, fuel, mm -hmm. and manufactured goods across Europe and beyond. Perfect. Very good for yeah. that. You. Kotaro. Okay, yeah. The answer is sanctions on Russia will lead to mm. rising mm. costs in food, fuel, and manufactured goods across Europe and beyond. Mm. Yes, mm. you can see the okay. answer in the second mm. paragraph. The second question, what was already being discussed in Europe before the conflict began? Uh, yeah. mm. Fears about the rising price of gas and the increasing cost of food 
were already being、uh, discussed in Europe before the conflict began. Very well said. That's correct. Fears about the rising price of gas and the increasing cost of good, food were already being discussed in Europe before the conflict began. Great. Let's have the third question. Why are there concerns that there will be a fall in the number of new cars being produced around the world?、Uh, because、uh, Russia supplies many of the natural materials required in the car manufacturing industry. The concerns、yes. will be a fall in the number of new cars. Yes.、Mm, thanks so much. <coughs> Very well. Now. The answer is because Russia supplies many of the natural materials required in the car manufacturing industry. So that's why they they have concern. Well,、um, why there will be a fall? Okay.、Yeah. Thank you so much. Okay. Now let's move on to the next activity, Kotaro. That is read out. Please read out the article. Okay.、Uh, the wider costs of the、uh, Ukraine conflict. Although most people are worried about the human cost of war, the conflict between Russia and Ukraine will also have a financial impact on countries around the world.、Mm -hmm. Sanctions on Russia will lead to rising costs in food, fuel, and manufactured goods across Europe and beyond. Fears about the rising price of gas and the increasing cost of food were already being discussed in Europe before the conflict began. Now, there are worries that interest rates will also rise to levels not seen since the 1980s. This will push prices up even further. Falling shares in stock markets around the world are also scaring people. Retired people sold their pension share prices fall rapidly. They are worried that their saving could be lost. People with mortgages will see their payments increase. As Russia supplies many of the natural materials required in the car manufacturing industry, they are concerned there will be a fall in the number of new cars being produced around the world. If the Russian government decides to、uh, retaliate and impose sanctions of its own, the impact of this conflict will be felt by everyone, in one way or another. Thank you so much for that, Kotaro. Good job. Let's just practice some words here. I will type some words in the chat box. Please repeat after me twice with these words: interest rates. Interest rates. Good. One more: interest rates. Interest rates. Good job. Next is rapidly. Rapidly. Thank you. One more: rapidly. Rapidly. Great. Now next. This word mort mortgages. 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 Cars. 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 R sound. R cars. 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 Great. Thank you so much for that, Kotaro. I think you did a very good job. Now we have fifteen minutes left. Let's discuss the questions below. We have here、okay. six questions, <coughs> all in all, and let's start with number one. Just feel free to express your ideas and opinions,、mm -hmm. or you can even just use the situation given. Yeah.、Okay. Let's start with number one. Have there、mm -hmm. been any price increases in your country recently? Share your thoughts. Oh、uh, yeah, yes. Hmm.、Uh, we have、uh, some price increasing experience in my country recently. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, mm, especially for the、uh, gas or fuel. Fuel.、Uh, mm -hmm. mm, price of gasoline. It's、mm -hmm. uh, it's increased fifty or sixty percent compared、mm -hmm. uh, with two months ago.、Uh, uh. So, uh, it's affect so much the、uh, people's living style. Mm. Mm. Currently, government consider how to reduce the cost of gasoline. Yeah,、yes. because every people use gasoline every day. Yeah,、mm. so、mm, it's very、mm, critical matter of our life. And、yeah. also,、mm, there are many、mm, price increasing, like uh, uh, not uh, fuel but、uh, electricity price also.、Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, because、uh, the source of、uh, generation of electricity is fuel、mm -hmm. mm, or the food. Yes,、uh, maybe、mm, I guess、uh, my country needs、uh, wheat. 
uh, come from uh, Ukraine, but uh, mm-hmm. as a result of war, mm-hmm. uh, the, uh, wheat was stopped, so uh, mm-hmm. it affect uh, the food price so much. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, currently not so much increase, but many uh, food company uh, mm-hmm. suggest that they will increase the price uh, mm-hmm. next month mm-hmm. or two months later. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so mm, it affect uh, mm, our uh, living style later. Yes. I guess. Yeah. yeah, it affects your resources, food resources, mm. since there's a war in, between Ukraine and Russia. Yeah, yes, yes. Mm. Mm. Thank you so much for sharing those, Kotaro. I do yeah. appreciate that. I'm so impressed. Now let's check the sample answers here. Let's start with the yes. Okay. Uh, yes, there have been price increases in my country recently because during the pandemic, there have been problem- problems with manufacturing, food mm-hmm. production, and with distribution caused mm-hmm. by travel restrictions. All of these things have led to an increase in costs. Mm-hmm. Thank you so much for that. And now yeah. let's have the no. Yes. Okay. No, there haven't been any price increases in my country recently because the prices here are stable because we have enough supply of most essential things. Mm. Nice country. Nice country. <laughs> I think there is such no country. Um, yeah. <laughs> yes, I guess that, so. <laughs> yes. Um, price in- increasing prices are like common of all mm. countries. Yeah. To all countries. Yes, yeah. Mm, yeah, I think so. It's a common problem you know, yeah. for every country, yes. Thank you. Now let's have the second question. Should people try to reduce their spending on essential items if they want to save money? Share your thoughts. Oh, uh, yeah. Mm, yes, I agree with this idea. Yeah, uh-huh. If uh, the people want to save money, mm-hmm. yeah, uh, they should reduce their uh, mm, living cost. Living cost. Yes, living cost. Yeah, essential mm-hmm. items like uh, food mm-hmm. or clothes or mm-hmm. uh, some mm, rental house cost. Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, it should be reduced uh, mm-hmm. because mm, the cost is mm, maybe the yes, uh, most mm, expensive one among our uh, monthly cost. Mm-hmm. So if uh, we can reduce such cost, yeah, we can save the money, mm, mm-hmm. more money. Mm, maybe. Yes. Yeah, you said they should reduce their living costs or leave living spendings. Yeah, Spend. yes, yes. Uh, if we have uh, um, some um, very uh, spending very huge money on Mm-mm. them, yeah, uh, there are, I think, minimum um, uh, criteria of using essential items. So um, we can't uh, reduce dramatically. Yeah. Uh, yeah. If there is uh, some space to reduce, mm-hmm. yeah, it's better. Oh, uh, like, can you um, tell me how can they reduce their spendings? Like, in what way can they reduce? Like, for example, uh, yeah. For example, if the person uh, mm, go out uh, mm-hmm. every night, mm-hmm. yeah, it reduces the frequency of going out with a friend or mm. uh, going restaurant. Mm. Or uh, if the person mm, buy a very uh, mm, experience mm-hmm. items mm-hmm. like a uh, nice shampoo or a nice <laughs> soap. Yeah, nice change uh, a little. Uh, yes, uh, yeah. mm, yes. Le- uh, Buy the cheaper one, one. Mm. cheaper one, or affordable yeah. one. Yeah. 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 Wow, what a nice idea! <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I just want to add um, that if you um, buy those branded ones, it's mm-hmm. better if you could um, buy the lower quality goods uh, yeah 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 yes yes mm. you can save money through that yeah yes yes i <laughs> think so <laughs> yeah because one of the reasons why like your money is not that you can't even like save your money you have a uh, mm. this amount of money and then you think mm. that why did i buy less items it's because you buy expensive ones but if mm. you buy cheaper you can buy a lot of quantity. I yeah, qua- yeah yes, quantity. Yeah. Yes, 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 that's right. Yeah. Let's <laughs> check the sample answers, please read. Okay. Uh, yes, people should try to reduce their spending on essential items because they can change the mm-hmm. brands mm-hmm. and they buy. Mm-hmm. 
by lower quality goods or buy them in smaller quantities in order to save money. Mm -hmm. mm. Yes. And next, the no. No, people shouldn't try to reduce their spending on essential items because they need to be comfortable. Mm -mm. These items are essential and it's really difficult to make reduction in these kinds of things. <laughs> How about you? Um... <laughs> Uh, for me, yeah, difficult? to reduce the cost, yeah, not so much difficult, yes, because uh, uh, I just choose a more low quality one or a more cheaper one. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's possible. It's and, possible. Yeah, I, yeah, I don't care so much about the changement. Mm. Ah, changes. Mm. Okay. Um, thank you so much for that, Qatar. I, yeah. I do really, um, Im I'm really impressed with your ideas. <laughs> <laughs> you are so straightforward with your ideas. Now let's check the third question. Yeah. Next question is, do you think that imports and exports should be the target of sanctions? Why or why not? Uh, mm, yeah, it's mm, difficult to say, but for Russia, mm -hmm. yeah, uh, the uh, sanctions for imports and exports have uh, uh, some... Mm, power mm -hmm. or uh, uh, affection uh, to the country, I think, because uh, currently uh, Russia's um, economy mm -hmm. is depending on uh, imports and exports, mm -hmm. especially for the uh, uh, foreign currency money. Mm -hmm. The method of getting uh, foreign currency money is exporting the uh, energetic source like uh, natural gas or oil. Mm -hmm. So um, if uh, the sanction targeted uh, exports of mm -hmm. such oil or natural mm -hmm. gas as uh, the Russia effect, uh, will be affected, will be, affe mm, will be affected so much, mm. I think. Mm. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Mm. But at the same time, it means so uh, from the viewpoint of importing country, mm -hmm. yes, also the damage was huge. Mm -hmm. Like European countries, yeah, many countries import. Uh, such oil or gas from Russia. Mm -hmm. So, currently they face uh, rising cost of of gas. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yes. All right. Very well said for that, Kotaro. Yeah. Now, <laughs> let's check the sample answer. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yes, guys, I think imports and exports should be the target of the sanctions because this can cut off the supply of money and the products to the uh, sanctioned, sanctioned country. Mm. It could force them to rethink their plans. Mm. Actually, um, this is like a big matter. <laughs> like, yeah. I have such no ideas about like um, pri high, high prices, like um, mm, mm, imports mm, and mm. exports. Yeah. Yeah, let's yes, have yes. the no. No, I think imports and exports shouldn't be the target of sanctions because this negatively affects both businesses and customers. Both businesses and customers. Hmm. Yeah, I think so. They will be affected too. Yeah, um, yes, yes. Especially mm. the shipping, shipping um, imports and exports, shipping <coughs> lines. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I think so. So mm, this uh, impact is very big. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Let's have the fourth question. Do you think that social media is important during conflicts? Why or why not? Uh, yeah. Mm, yes, I think so. Yes. Uh, mm. Currently, uh, mm, war between Russia and Ukraine both use uh, some mm, SNS tool to uh, mm, appeal uh, current their status. Yeah, mm -hmm. actually, both said uh, now they are winning, but mm, mm -hmm. yeah, it's very important to appeal uh, yes. and also uh, mm, to control uh, the opinion of other countries. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and also some case uh, the for uh, the citizens uh, in the uh, Ukraine or Russia, mm -hmm. uh, they can mm, show a realistic status of the country. Yeah. Mm. Uh, normally, uh, before uh, uh, um, arriving uh, social media, mm. uh, the word status is normally unclear, unclear. to understand mm. uh, from other people, other countries, because uh, only uh, 
uh, check the status by some、um, official document or official comment. And、mm-hmm. some cases, the official comment is modified.、Uh, yes. or, or,、mm. yeah. So,、uh, the social media can show、uh, actual status of the country.、Mm. So, it's a very important point、mm. uh, during the conflicts. During the conflict. Thank you so much for that, Kotaro. You have a、yes. big point on that. It's,、uh, you said appeal the current status. It's so important to have social media because、mm-hmm. so that other、um, people from all over the world can be updated, can know what's、mm-hmm. happening with, with your country, and they can、mm-hmm. help.、Um, yeah. Social media can help、um, spread information about your、mm. country,、mm. but in,、uh, on the other hand, there are also cons of、mm. using social media.、Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. I think so.、Mm. Let's start, let's start、um, checking the sample answer. Please read.、Yeah. Uh, yes, social media is important during conflicts because it allows information to spread quickly,、mm. and in some cases, This could even help save lives. Yes, save、mm. lives.、Yeah. I agree on this. This yes, could even、yes. help save lives.、Mm. Because yeah, there are、yes. people out there that do not have social media, and whoever has a cell phone or social media can spread it all over the world, and many people can,、um, can help them. Yeah. Yes, yes, I think so. Yeah. Actually, yeah. the SNS is one of the most fastest information tools. So,、yes. if the, some city is、mm-hmm. uh, got, uh, attacked by an、mm-hmm. enemy, yes, the information will spread soon. So,、yes. uh, near the area,、uh, the citizens can evacuate from the area. Yes. yes. Unlike,、um, unlike the days,、uh, unlike before, before、mm-hmm. the social media.、Um, Was worn, so、hmm. um, accidents, emergencies were not、um, were not being, how to say that,、um, like the nurses or the medical、hmm. cannot hmm. respond hmm. quickly because of having、hmm. no social media. So it's、yeah. better that we have social media.、Hmm. Yes, yes. Let's check the no. It's in the chat box. Okay. No, I don't think social media is important during conflicts because it can be used to spread the false information. And this makes it difficult to trust what is appearing on our news feeds.、Mm. <laughs> it also <laughs> has a point. I、yeah. think social media is important.、Mm, <laughs> spread false information. Yeah, yeah actually.、Mm. Yeah. <laughs> All right,、uh, I think we, we just have to finish it here,、yeah. um, Kotaro,、yes. because our、mm. time is running out. We、yeah. have finished four questions, and maybe you have to continue the two、mm. other questions in your next lesson.、Yeah. But you did a very good job in this lesson, Kotaro. I、yeah. think that、um, something that we have to practice on, on your English skills is your、yeah. pronunciation with R、mm. only. And、yeah. good job for that. You're fluent.、Yeah. Have a good day to you, Kotaro. Yeah,、Keep、have a good day, you too. Thank nice you so、day. much for the lesson. Yeah, bye bye.、So、bye bye. And that's the lesson for today, guys. I hope that you're going to learn. Wait, I'm not going to show you. Wait, I'm not going to show you my income. It's so small. Thank you for watching my video, guys. Thank you so much. That's all for today, daily news. Bye!